Over here, you can see that I have a, a photo of a person right here with closed eyes. And if you want to make those eyes open, then what you can do is you can go around over here onto the eye tool and click on open closed eyes. So once you do that, what happens is that it'll analyze out the picture that you have right here. And then you can choose from one of these sample eyes right here. So you can go around and click and you can see that the eye has been replaced and you can see the before and after right here. You can also go around choose another type of eyes right here or you can go around and select this eye or this eye right here and you can see that you can just go around and choose the one you like just like that. So once you're happy, you can go around and press OK and those eyes will be applied and you can see that it looks quite natural right here. Let me just go around and press Ctrl Z and click on open closed eyes once more. What you can also do is you can go around and browse photos from your photo bin right here or from your computer as well and choose from the um, uh, photos uh, that you have right here. So I'm just going to go to computer right here and I'm going to go around onto my desktop where I have a person with open eyes right here. Let me just open that out right here and you can see that it took that eye. You can go around and click and the eye will be replaced as you can see just like this from this particular photo over here. And you, you can see that it didn't even take much time right here. And you can go around, press OK, and that uh, those eyes will be replaced, as you can see, just like that. So that is how you can go around and then use the um, uh, eye tool to open closed eyes inside of Adobe Photoshop Elements. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.